Hi. Hello, how are you? Mambo, sasa? So guys, today we're going to talk about how to lose weight. No. <laughs> ah, scratch that. How to gain weight. Yes, how to gain weight. And if you don't know where this is coming from, in case you're wondering, like you're just curious, like why are you talking about how to gain weight? Well, I'm going to explain. So basically, if you don't follow me on my channel, I did a video called Thin Shaming in Africa, where basically I was talking about <sighs> the beauty standard in Africa, which is being big and how some of us skinny people are actually thin shamed it was just a funny clip so it was not serious so guys let's just get into the video if you're skinny and you want to put on weight or if you're underweight and you want to put on weight let's proceed with the video don't don't uh, worry we are going to add weight and also i'm a health educator that is my profession so i know what i'm talking so tip number one if you want to add weight is actually don't worry there's a notebook here <laughs> So if you see me looking like I'm reading something, I am reading something. So if you want to add weight, it's definitely to eat more frequently. Um, one thing you should know is that food has calories and uh, calories equals energy, which equals fats. <laughs> so if you actually want to add weight, you should eat more frequently. And um, for example, if you're eating three meals a day, I suggest that you add one extra meal. So uh, basically, it's all about adding to what you're eating because you want to add weight you don't want to maintain your weight uh, so you have to add to what you're eating it can be a glass of milk you, you know like add a high calorie food like milk of yogurt you can add basically add to what you eat every single day for example if you eat breakfast lunch supper you can add a snack at around 10 o'clock a.m or you can add another snack at sakumi or 4 p.m and definitely you're going to add weight because the extra calories that you're using uh, will go into storage so eat more food to give you is to actually eat more nutrient rich food or foods that have more nutrients uh for example you can uh instead of maybe you used to eat light foods that are basically meaningless like crisps and all that what you can do is maybe add more vegetables add more fruits you can add a cup of juice to your diet you get the drift add more nutrient rich food and nutrient rich foods are definitely foods that are high in nutrients and i go back to milk milk is high in nutrients eggs are high in nutrients yeah so you can add especially those two things eggs and milk if you normally don't have them in your diet you can add them to your diet yes, yes. another thing that i would advise somebody to do is actually to increase their portion size what does that mean it basically means that you should increase the amount of food you're eating per sitting so for example the first one that i talked about was eating more frequently we're talking about is if you're eating three times a day what you can do is increase the amount that you're eating instead of increasing it to four times a day you can maintain the three times a day but increase the portion size if you are eating half a kg of ugali for my fellow africans or kenyans if you're eating half a kg of ugali you can eat now one kg of ugali and that is going to make you add weight definitely because the ugali is basically going to be stored as fat in your body or if you normally gym it's going to be um, converted to muscle and therefore you will add weight so increase your portion size if you normally eat two eggs eat three eggs if you normally to drink two glasses of milk at a certain time as a snack eat drink three glasses of milk so increase your portion size so we've had the common uh, phrase that if you want to lose weight do not eat before bedtime so now that we want to gain weight what do we do we eat before bedtime so you can have a snack before bedtime that is uh, and you know that uh, you're not going to spend any in okay you're going to spend energy at night but not much not like during the day so that food is probably going to end up in storage and therefore going to make you gain weight so yeah eat a snack before bedtime or eat a heavy meal before bedtime definitely that's going to make you gain weight and um yeah this video doesn't mean that i i advocate for uh uh heavy weight as i said about thin shaming in africa i do not advocate for like adding weight like just for beauty and being obese or what is it called overweight it's just for those people who are actually underweight and they feel that they should add weight or who are like me i'm borderline underweight actually my bmi is borderline i'm not yet 
underweight. No, I'm not underweight. I'm in the normal range, but uh, my BMI is borderline underweight. So if you're like me and you do not want to enter the underweight category and you want to add more weight um, and also your underweight, these are just the tips that I'm giving you. So don't think that I'm advocating here like, oh, after my previous video, maybe that I'm advocating for the ideals that Africans um, think that we should be overweight in order to look beautiful. No, that is not... And also, I'm not body shaming anybody who is overweight, it's just to help those people who are underweight. Another tip that I'm going to give you is that, for example, if you do not like big meals, as I've said, increase your portion size, you can eat several small meals. So what do I mean by this? I mean that you can eat, instead of eating three or four times a day, you can eat like even up to eight times a day. For example, you can just take like your breakfast, like a very light breakfast, which can be tea and a piece of bread, and then... Afterwards, after like two hours, you can eat again, you can eat like an apple, and then after like one hour, you can take a cup of yogurt. After another hour, maybe now around lunch hour, you can eat a very light lunch, and then again, after two hours, you can take another snack, kama mandazi, if you're an African, you know what that is, you can donut, and then after two hours, again, you can eat. So instead, if you're not the person to kind of sit down with ugali and fish, or ugali and milk and meat and eggs and you no know, Africans, you know what I'm talking about. If you're not the kind to eat that, you can eat several small meals. Maybe because because most of the time people who are skinny tend to not really eat big meals or to be unable to eat big meals. So if you're unable to eat big meals, I personally know I have that problem. I'm unable to eat big meals. Eat more frequently. You'll find yourself adding weight. So that is another tip that I'm going to definitely avoid drinking water right before um taking a meal some people might subconsciously do that if you're the kind of person who normally drinks water right before a meal oh from today henceforth if you want to add weight do not drink water right before a meal because it usually affects um you feel temporarily full when you're actually not full so do not drink water right before eating a meal however thirsty you are just hold on eat and then take water or take water like um about 30 to one, 30 minutes to one hour before you eat that meal so if you're the kind who takes water before eating a meal make sure that you do not take water before eating a meal because it's going to affect your appetite and right now we want to gain weight so we need that appetite more knowledge that stress actually leads to weight loss or yeah so uh, make sure that you relax that's another tip i'm giving you relax relax it's never ever that serious and um case you're going through trying trying times make sure that you talk to somebody make sure you talk to a therapist or your family or your friends and make sure that you relax and also make sure that you're having adequate sleep so those that really helps with weight gain so make sure that you're relaxed and have adequate sleep adequate sleep means about eight hours according to researchers so make sure that you're having at least your eight hours of sleep and relax relax guys those are the tips that I'm going to give you because I feel that those tips are actually the most important tips when it comes to gaining weight. It's all about the food. And the reason I mentioned that you should eat nutrient-rich, dense food is that people tend to have the misconception that they are supposed to actually eat snacks and junk food so that they can gain weight. You don't have to eat snacks and junk food to gain weight. Hi, Joseph. Hi. Hi. Say hi. Hi. Okay, bye. <laughs> Say bye. Bye. Okay. Oh, what was I saying? So people tend to have the misconception that you're supposed to actually eat a lot of junk food and a lot of uh, snacks in order to gain weight. Uh, unfortunately, that is just going to make you unhealthy and it's also going to make you deficient, like nutrient deficient. So make sure that you're eating nutrient-dense food like sweet potatoes, um, eggs, milk, yogurt, you know, all that good stuff you can google nutrient dense foods and you're gonna find a list of nutrient dense foods and don't fill yourself with snacks and junk food as i said that's just going to make you unhealthy so you want to add weight healthily and yes that is all that i have for you guys i hope that you enjoyed this video and uh, clearly i can see that you watched until this point don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like and i'll see you in my next video